Okay, so here's the sheet off the portal. I'll put the link to where the sheet is down below. But the way this works is you do your AC performance test and you find out if you have uh, high discharge pressure, high suction pressure, low suction pressure, high suction pressure, and then also check your suction line. So that's the line between the expansion valve outlet back to the compressor. Is it cold and frosty or is it warm and dry? All right, so the way the sheet works is these two boxes up here are suction, suction being the low side. So I'm just gonna color these all blue. All right, so if your suction pressure is too high, you use the high suction chart. Leaking compressor reads, low compressor RPM, defective open expansion valve, compressor capacity low, just worn out. High discharge pressure also causes high suction. Low suction pressure is these things. You want to do them from top to bottom. So the most common problem will usually be the top. So work the top down. All right. The next two boxes talk about discharge. So on this side you can see high discharge pressure. On this side you can see normal to low discharge pressure. All right. I think in the quiz we asked um, what causes high discharge. So we got re re Restricted condenser airflow, you know, fans in op, bugs, dirt, uh, NCG, overcharge, restricted discharge line, etc. All right. Now, down in this area here on the very bottom, remember, this is the suction line. So I'm just right suction. So you look at the suction line, if it's cold and frosted, there's a couple things. So it could be restricted airflow on the evaporator, frost or ice on the coil, defective open expansion valve. So if I got a cold, frosted line, and um, where's the stuck open expansion valve right here high suction so if I had high suction and a cold frosted line that'd be the first thing that's uh, common between the two I would look at that all right on this side is a warm dry suction line of course most of the time it's going to be just a moist line cool moist line so if it doesn't fit in that category you can use this as more things to look at all right really nice sheet to tell you where to go once you run your performance test